Over to you, Pete. Pete, can you hear me? Just wondering, how's it all going down there? I understand they've been on sale now for two minutes. Well, it's just the most amazing frenzy. If anything, the uh, drama that's going on here and the hysteria that's going on here for the launch of the second iPad is much bigger than what happened when the first one was launched about a year ago, and I was here for that one too. There are hundreds of people who are standing in the street watching what's going on. Hundreds more have been queuing around the block for the last 48 hours, and they're all finally getting to go inside, and it's all about this little number. This is the iPad number two, which is smaller, faster, Faster, sharper, brighter than iPad number one. I wish I was, but there you go. <laughs> anyway, everybody's inside. Everybody's going to buy these things. They range in price from about $600 all the way up to $950. They're incredibly popular. And when you see what's going on here tonight, you can understand why the iPad is the fastest selling electronic item in the history of the planet. 15 million sold last year alone. Pete, you've had a, a sneak peek today. Any major differences between the first one and, and the new one? Well, it's smaller, not much smaller, but it is smaller. It's a bit lighter. Uh, it's, a bit, it's a bit brighter. It carries a camera for the first time, something that Apple brought in with the iPhone and surprisingly didn't bring in with the first iPad. But beyond that, it does much the same sort of thing. It downloads all your apps. You can write all your messages and email on it. You can do everything with this that you could do with the previous version of the iPad, uh, with the addition, of course, as I say, that you can take pictures with this one and presumably you can hold Skype conversations as well. Apple certainly know how to do a product launch. All right, Peter Harvey, thank you so sure much do. for that. No doubt those scenes are being repeated right across the country. Well, former